You know, it's enough for we are sleep with our worst enemies. And we know, but we won't leave that person. You see, you men want to make women outward appearance fool on too much and get to the head too much. That's why I have to big up the man and we look, we look on the inside and not the outside. There are men like that, but most men look on how a girl run and take up. You will know, say, a girl no mean you no good. And too, she cock up and she run and, her, and she clean and them things and she chrome. You know, I left her when you know in yourself, say, the girl no mean you no good. You understand what I say? For instance, I have this friend in the day with this girl. And her birthday was like, was like a month. In a month time, and the girl knows that the boy had this money put on and I see if I buy one vehicle for them stop walk. And the girl tell the boy, say she want a birthday party and she want wig and ear and nails and shoes and this and that. So, him to say, B, you know, say me I save the money for buy one little car for <laughs> So 12 year old St. Elizabeth boys are facing rape charges in relation to the sexual assault of two young girls in the parish. The new steam source says the charges stem from two incidents, one in July 2022 and the other in January of this year. Their alleged victims are 12 and 6 year old. Both of the alleged perpetrators have been charged with rape. One of the boys is also facing a charge of aiding and abetting rape in relation to the January incident. The St. James police are trying to identify the body of a man discovered on the Bog Hill Main Road on Wednesday morning. The body was found with gunshot wounds around 6 a.m. Residents reported hearing explosions around 12.30 a.m. The body is of dark complexion, medium built and about 5 feet 8 inches long and was clad in a white merino and black jeans. The dead man appeared to be in his mid-40s and had dreadlocks. Anyone with information that can assist the police in identifying the body is asked to contact the Montego Bay Police Station at 876-979-8452, Police 119 Emergency Number, or the nearest police station. Vibes Cartel speaks on new EP says Valiance reminds him of himself. Dancehall star Vice Cartel has been incarcerated since 2011, but that has not stopped him from releasing singles and even albums. The world boss is back at it again as he prepares to release an 8-track EP titled Numb on April 28, 2023. In an interview coordinated by his eldest son, Lika Vibes, Cartel spoke scandally telling Don Salmag that the project is inspired by his fiancé Saidem Ostrog, a Turkish social worker. The concept numb. The title numb came from a conversation I was having with my fiance side him. She was telling me that she felt numb without me, and the only time she feels whole is when she is playing my music. That's when the idea hit me to do all girls song album with the title numb, representative of how the ladies feel without cartel in their ears. Vibes Cartel explained. Produced by DJ Imra Cards and distributed by Zojak Worldwide, NUM will include Without You, NUM, Vaccine, I Only Wanted You, About Last Night, Playboy Bunny, The Search Is Over, and Home featuring Savage Stable. <laughs>